Hey guys, welcome back to my video. So Roblox Bed Wars has just updated. Baker Golden Apple plus Mobile Interact Button. So this is a random number generator. Whatever number it picks is how many likes this video must get. So can we get 820 likes on this video? Throw them on smash that like button. And if you're brand new, please subscribe. It does help out a ton. With that being said, let's go ahead and get started. Next week is season seven on Roblox Bed Wars. This season will change the entire game. Speaking of season seven, it's the last week for season six. Three times XP is active for the entire week. Last chance to get level 50. So the first part of the update is the brand new mobile interact button for any player that plays on mobile if the player keeps moving it is super hard to press the ability all right so i'm currently on mobile let's go ahead and test out this brand new button any mobile players that are watching this video just note that i hate playing on mobile i'm guessing that this button's for the kit ability the one with the hand i decided to play with the evelyn kit so we have the teleport the player soul so if i just click the hand button will this work and look at that, it just worked. Kits such as Kalia, Hannah, and Evelyn, this will definitely be useful. The Baker Kit got a brand new item. So in the patch notes, Baker Kit has received a golden apple. I'm using normal Baker, and my friend is playing a Spirit Baker. Does the kit skin change the golden apple? In the shop, you can buy a golden apple for five emeralds. Why is it so expensive? A normal apple does cost 30 iron, but the golden one is five emeralds. Normal apple and golden apple. Look at that difference. Normal apple, golden apple. It seems that with the Spirit Baker kit skin, the apple for golden stays the exact same. Hopefully the devs do add a spirit version. A normal apple heals by 40 HP and time for the golden apple. When you eat the apple for 15 seconds, you regen health faster and also you take less damage. So that is great. A wooden sword does 20 damage without the golden apple and the wooden sword just did 17 damage. As you can see, I took three less damage. So it's about a 15% damage reduction. This is the regen of health here. As you can see, this is actually very OP. I'm just gaining all my health back whenever he hits me. I can never die. For five emeralds for 15 seconds, is it really worth it? Probably in rank squads, better off buying a diamond sword. And in the shop, the backpacks are all removed. The first aid kit, the vending machine, and the spike shell. They did the exact same for season five, but maybe in the next season, we could see some new backpacks. Before I read the changes on my Discord server, I'm giving away a season seven battle pass to three lucky winners. To enter, join my Discord server, link down below in the description. Go to the top channel and click react. This Saturday is my Q&A and meet and greet on my Discord server. You don't wanna miss it. Free kits of the week are free. Uh, Conqueror and Miner. Miner kit is not considered the best farming kit in the entire game. Out of all three kits, use Miner. At the middle of the map are the Emeralds. One Emerald spawns every 55 seconds. But however, the devs have made it so Emeralds spawn every 45 seconds, a difference of 10 seconds. The solo's game mode is ruined by the crossbow. Every player rushes mid. The first player with a crossbow technically wins the game. This makes getting a crossbow a lot easier. Hell Pearls now cost two emeralds each. This change was definitely needed. For one emerald, the ability to teleport was crazy. Two emeralds is definitely a lot more fair. Comment down below, is two emeralds fair? This right here is the Rage Blade. It is known for being the most powerful sword in the entire game. Well, the devs have just buffed it. The Rage Blade always did 65 damage and now it does 70 damage, an increase of five. With the Fisherman Kit, all the Iron Fishes are increased by 1.5%. Traps always costed 32 iron. The devs have changed the price to 24 iron, a decrease of eight. Freya's Ice Sword only costs three emeralds, no longer costs four. All tier two upgrades on Aetune's Hammer now cost five crystals each, no longer being seven. With Lumen's Light Sword, walk speed while charging the sword increased by 10%, for a total of 85%. The light charge is now faster. The fact that this sword only costs two emeralds is crazy. It does way more damage than the diamond sword and it's so much better. Wim's ice balls now ground enemies for eight seconds. While being grounded, you can't use balloons, your kit dashes or teleports with pearls. The devs keep buffing Wim kit. I would call it the most annoying free kit in the entire game. After a couple of months, this has finally been fixed. With the team scoreboard of kill, it finally shows the accurate amount. On the infected game mode, this has been there for already a week. 
but infected players can now double jump. I just forgot but with Lonnie Scepter, no longer can be used while grounded, completely out of the meta. Next week is Season 7, I'm super hyped about that. Drop a like and subscribe. Use Starcom out of buying Robux and I'll see you guys next time. Peace!